Hi everyone, my name is Philip. I'm a machine learning engineer at Hugging Face and the tech lead for our partnership with AWS. I will show you in a few minutes how you can deploy Hugging Face transformers from S3 to Amazon SageMaker for inference. Amazon SageMaker is a fully managed machine learning service that provides everyone with the ability to build, train and deploy machine learning models quickly. Together with AWS, we have built an inference optimized solution to deploy transformer models as SageMaker endpoints. Let's get started. We are going to use a SageMaker notebook instance to deploy our model. Using a SageMaker notebook instance is not a requirement to deploy your model. You can also use SageMaker Studio or you can deploy it from your local machine. To be able to deploy a model from S3 to Amazon SageMaker, you need to create an archive called model.tar.gc which contains all the relevant model and tokenizer files. If you have trained your model before using the Amazon SageMaker and the Hugging Face DLC for training, this archive will be created automatically for you at the end of your training and uploaded to S3. So if you have already trained a model, you can use this model for deployment. In this case, I will use a distal bird model fine-tuned on the SST2 dataset. To deploy our model, we first need to create a Hugging Face model class. The Hugging Face model class contains all the relevant information for our endpoint as our model data, where the model archive is stored on S3, a role for the permissions, our transformers version, and the Python or TensorFlow version. The Hugging Face inference solution is, um, can be used with PyTorch or TensorFlow. After we created our Hugging Face model class, we can run Dot deploy. The dot deploy method will then create our SageMaker endpoint. Therefore, we define the initial instance count and the instance type. The initial in instance count defines how many instances will be used for our endpoint, and the instance type defines which instance will be used. In our example, I use the M5 instance, which is a CPU based instance. After executing this, SageMaker will create our endpoint, which takes around five minutes. The endpoint has been successfully deployed to SageMaker and can now be used for inference. The benefit of using the Python SageMaker SDK is that the dot .deploy method automatically returns predictor class, which we can use to request our endpoint. Therefore, we can run predictor.predict .predict and provide our inputs. As an input, I have a yeah, simple sentence phrase. Um, executing predictor.predict. .predict our endpoint successfully predicts the correct class for our input and works. At the end, you can run predictor.delete endpoint, which makes sure everything will be deleted on SageMaker properly. If you want to learn more about Hugging Face on Amazon SageMaker, check out huggingface.co slash SageMaker.